Granularity is very important when we're figuring out tests. If you make your test too big, it becomes unwieldy. If they're too small, they're also unwieldy. That would be too fine of a granular setting for this. So this is very much a Goldilocks situation. After you've done a few projects, you get a feel for what the correct granularity is. Once we've got a good list of tasks available for us, the next thing to do is to organize them from what needs to come first through what will be the last thing until our project is gold and ready to be published. So we're going to start with possibly a storyboard or create, and once we've got the storyboard or at the same time that the storyboard's being created, we might create start creating the assets or uh, working with the game engine or uh, Blender or Maya or whatever tool we're using to do the actual an animation process with. Once we have these organized in what the flow will be, what comes first, what comes second, etc.